Hi, my name is Tony Sloak. I'm a realtor with Sky Realty here in Austin, Texas, and I'm here to show you yet another gorgeous Seven Oaks listing. This home was an award-winning home, Parade of Homes in 2006. The architect and the builder wanted you to envision a home on the cliffs in Santa Barbara, California, overlooking the Pacific Ocean. It features over 10,000 square feet. It's got six bedrooms and uh, six baths with two half baths. Let's go inside and take a look. Come on inside and take a look at this gorgeous home. As you enter the home, you see this really nice formal living area with a dramatic travertine fireplace, iron chandelier, and as you come to the right over here, you'll see the formal dining room, which is located just off this gentleman's bar with a spectacular uh, wine cellar that's climatized. One of my favorite parts of this home is this dramatic great room with 32-foot ceilings, huge iron chandeliers, and balconies on both sides where the bedrooms upstairs and the uh, video room are, the media room. Can you imagine your family yelling from the upstairs, come on, it's time to go to school, let's go, get dressed. I sure can. There's gorgeous hill country views out the window, another dramatic fireplace. All of it flows into this open kitchen. This kitchen features top of the line appliances. It kind of has that uh, French country accent with a dramatic vent hood over the Wolf stainless steel oven, double oven. It's got two dishwashers on one side, bread warmer, gorgeous countertops, great backsplash. And then the breakfast area straight ahead, that's where the family lives here. They live in this breakfast area and right off the kitchen and in the great room here. They say they spend 80% of their time here. It leads out to the beautiful outside. We're gonna talk about that last. It's a spectacular backyard. Off to the other side of the kitchen over here, you'll see um, that there is a large pantry, plenty of room to put lots of food items. Then you have a small kitchen office over here on the other side. And then off to the right over here is a, a large uh, laundry pantry area. Then um, back over here, we've got the exit to the garage and a uh, small powder bath. Now, now that we've seen this side of the house, I'd love to take you to the other side and show you the master suite. It's truly phenomenal. Come this way. So this place really has a special master suite wing. Come on, check it out. Now, before we get into this really incredible master bedroom and bath, there's a little pool bath down here off the side that can go straight out to the pool area. You don't have to trample around through the house with wet feet. Um, all the floors are travertine. Anyway, this is the master suite, and it is truly amazing. Um, it's got uh, coffered ceilings with beams, uh, arched accents. Um, the the, the spa-like master bath here is incredible. If you're a, uh, um, a bathroom person, this is the one for you. So come on over here and take a look. Hang a right over here first, and you'll see that it's got uh, his and her vanity, but really it's got two vanities in her vanity and then a fourth one over here. Notice the chairs, there's a TV above. The current owners tell me that they end up sitting in this room quite often just watching TV. You got a spa-like tub, got a walk-in shower. I mean, it's, 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 this thing is phenomenal. It's like walking into a spa. So really, really special master bath. It's the nicest master bath I've seen in Seven Oaks and I've seen a lot. Now check out the closet. It's, it's a room into itself. Uh, it's got um, triple stacked racks for clothes hanging, lots of room for shoes behind the island here, you know, lots of built-ins, really, really complements the master bath well. Let's head over to the office. So this this wing, really, it's all, all inclusive. You have your, your master bedroom, master bath, uh, your office and then a third suite that could also be used as an office if you needed that as well. So come on in here and, and check out this office. It's truly amazing. It's um, a great, great hardwood floors, the um, another uh, custom solid iron chandelier. Uh, looks like it has candles. It's got the Chicago style bricks that they imported for this house. Lots of Alderwood built in cabinets. And then behind the desk is what you call here a computer niche. Um, the, the current owner, he spends a lot of time in this office, uh, you know, just kind of tinkering and playing with his, with his stuff and, and, and doing business. So over here, um, 
This room here originally was planned as a second office, but it's currently uh, decorated as a suite. It has, once again, its own bathroom. Uh, you could have uh, a young child that you didn't want too far from the master bedroom, or the elderly parent who can't get up the stairs. This room would be perfect for them. But, you know, everything you see in this Tom Hobbs built home is finished out with the highest, highest grade finish outs. It's really, really amazing. I don't think you could find a home built this nice in the entire Eames School District. Now that we've seen this really incredible master wing, let's head upstairs and let me show you where the kiddos would be. So we go through the entryway with the, with the formal living, formal dining room, and you've got these really great South American wood stairs heading up with a decorative solid iron banister and another incredible iron chandelier off to the left here. This area really is great. It opens up the entire upstairs, you get this open feel, but you're still connected to the downstairs, right? Anything going on upstairs, you can see what's going on down. Anything downstairs, you can see what's going on upstairs. So off to the right over here is a private suite. This room, I would say, would be perfect for a live-in nanny or a live-in maid. And she's got its own bathroom come through the bathroom here and you'll see that it's attached to the media room. And this media room has been laid out really great. It's got a wet bar with a refrigerator and a microwave. Everything's tied into this enormous screen. The shades are electric. You can see there's a balcony out there with a pool table and gorgeous hill country, distant hill country views. Let me show you where the kiddos will be over here. You know, the first time I saw this house, I can only imagine a family running around and, and mom's in the kitchen and the kids are up here getting ready for school and she's getting them to hurry and breakfast is ready, come downstairs. It's just, it's just perfect for a family. So each bedroom upstairs, this is the first one, each bedroom upstairs has its own bathroom. Which is what you're looking for when you're looking at a home of this caliber. You want the bedrooms to have their own bathrooms. So the second bedroom upstairs, the current owners are using it as a workout room, but it has a laundry room upstairs. How great is that? To have a washer and dryer upstairs so you don't have to haul the clothes up and down. So this room's being used currently as their workout room. You can see the equipment there, but it has its own bathroom as well. So that's the second room. And then the third room is uh, my favorite up here. Once again, you've got this great open feeling here where everybody, even though it's a 10,000 square foot house, can see each other, hear each other. Then you've got this really great bedroom here that has its own bath, its own window looking out over the hill country. The kids are gonna fight over this room for sure. It's got the nicest bathroom upstairs, nice, nice tile, travertine tile laid in the, in the shower there. So you've got four bedrooms upstairs, two bedrooms downstairs, and now uh, what I'd really like to show you is the outside. The outside is resort inspired, really makes you feel like you're in the cliffs over Santa Barbara looking out over the Pacific Ocean. Come on, let me show you. So I told you the great room was my most favorite part of this home, but really it's the outdoor living space. You've got a full outdoor kitchen, it's got a wolf grill, refrigerator, I love the cobalt blue tile, accented with the saltillo tile on the bottom. And as you step out here, look at the hill country views. And you have the small wading pool, a large swimming pool, and a spa, 60 feet total. You've got three, four different water features, five different water features. And then over here, you'll see that it's got another outdoor living space. kind of a, an area where the family now kind of hangs out, watches TV, maybe has dinner at night. And as you walk through there and up to the right, you'll see where it accesses the master suite. So if you're in the master, you have your own private entrance to the pool area. Take a look around the corner over there.
So you can see that the owners can enjoy themselves privately there and then just jump in the pool and come right back to their, their bedroom. So all in all, this is a really, really great house. If you would uh, like to take a private tour of this home, like to know a little bit more about it, give me a call at 512-299-8574 or email me at tony at skyrealtyaustin.com. I'd love to show you the house right away. Thanks.